Hi everybody, and sorry for the poor quality um, camera today, having some issues with the other one. Hopefully this should come out alright, anyway. Um, it's just my phone camera, so I'm hoping it's okay. So here we are, I'm going to put, this is the banana and apple wine. It's been sitting in the fermentation bucket for a week now. I'm now going to put it into a demijohn, so we can have a little look at what it is inside. It bubbles much more than the uh, the side of us. I'm assuming that's just because of the extra sugar. So more sugar, uh, the more the yeast is going to eat it up. But I'll let you have a look. It looks a bit gruesome. This is like banana wine. <laughs> but you can see lots of bubbling in there. It smells it smells really good. But yeah, lots and lots of air. Uh, uh, bubbles, lots of fermentation going on, that's for sure. So, I've got my sterilised demijohns just sitting over there, so I'm going to take this siphon tube, and it's going to go, this, this end is going to go into the fermentation bucket, and I'm going to, uh, yeah, put it into a demijohn, so... Next, so here we are, guys. I've siphoned off the banana wine into uh, the demijohn. So yeah, I got a fair amount of sludge coming through on this one, which didn't happen with my previous ones. Um, I think I didn't use a very good strainer, and plus some of the the yeast and banana matter that collected on the surface, I think it escaped um, into my siphoning. So. Hopefully, this will be absolutely fine. I can't. It's going to get filtered again once I uh, transfer it to what's it called? Uh, to wine bottles. But uh, yeah, we'll see. It smells gorgeous, so I'm really happy with how this is going. Anyway, and uh, so yes, we've attached the um, the airlock. So this I use distilled water in it. I believe some people use. Um, Camden tablets in it again I'm trying to keep my wine and cider as organic as possible and uh, yeah I've just finished um, doing this is a, some plum cider I had in a demijohn and I've just had a little taste of this and it's absolutely gorgeous so that's going to sit for another week with some what's it, uh, I've carbonated these so they've had a couple of teaspoons of sugar each I think I actually put three or four <laughs> teaspoons in because I like a, a sweet side of myself. Um, but yeah, we can see already there's a lot of fermentation going on in the wine demijohns. I've literally only just put this uh, airlock in and it usually takes a couple of minutes for the air to start bubbling out of a cider airlock. But in this wine, I don't know if it'll come up on this camera very well, but... There's so many uh, bubbles coming up from the fermentation, and it'll it does this for quite some time. So, yeah, I shall update you all on the uh, progress of the banana wine. But one thing I always try and do, I've got a little uh, here it is. There's a tag. So banana wine. This was created on the twentieth. And what I do is just write the date that it was put into a demijohn as well. And this is going to take at least another, uh, so it's going to take two months now. So it's uh, a week in the fermentation bucket and another month, sorry, two months in the uh, demijohn here. Excellent. All right, thanks, guys. Hope you enjoyed the update. Bye for now.